it has been a year since the start of the coronavirus pandemic. Which countries have done the best to protect its citizens and its economy? Which places have zero COVID-19 cases? How did each country achieve this success? Those are some of the questions we will try answering in this video. But first please make sure you are following us on our social media platforms. Let's start. A successful reaction to COVID-19 turned out to depend on more than just money or scientific power. Easy examples are the United States and the United Kingdom, both have suffered a lot from the pandemic. Since the pandemic started, one in every 990 Americans have died from COVID-19. During the second and third wave of the virus, many other countries that did well initially, like Canada and some European nations, failed to continue on the same path because the governments and the people grew tired of adopting safety requirements. For Asian countries the process was easier. Since people are used to wear masks when they feel ill. So they adopted masks early and widely when the pandemic began. The best country at early reaction is Taiwan. Taiwan have reported one COVID-19 death per 3,300,000 people. Since Taiwan was the first to recognize COVID-19 cases among travelers coming from Wuhan, China, the country have reacted rapidly by halting the flights from most of China, quarantined travelers from other regions and stopped cruise ships and carried out extensive tests and adopted early masks wearing. They also provided people with money to spend on their daily needs. Taiwan has just under 800 cases during 2020, while also preventing lockdowns. The best country at crushing the curve is New Zealand. New Zealand have reported one COVID-19 death per 204,000 people. New Zealand is also an island like Taiwan, which make it easier to impose travel bans. New Zealand introduced a nationwide lockdown by the end of March, with a goal of zero COVID cases. The pandemic was declared over in New Zealand by June. All of the later cases came from foreign tourists who were held in isolation for two weeks. The best location in the U.S. is American Samoa. American Samoa have zero reported COVID cases. American Samoa remains the only territory in the U.S. without any COVID-19 cases. In an attempt to stave off the virus early, all incoming passenger flights were halted by the territory. American Samoa did not have any lockdowns or wide testing. 100 years ago, similar measures allowed the territory to prevent any deaths from the influenza pandemic in 1918. The best country in testing is South Korea. South Korea have reported one COVID-19 death per 63,000 people. South Korea tested early and rapidly when it was known that individuals without symptoms could transmit COVID-19 testing more than twice as many tests per capita as other countries in the first weeks of the pandemic. This stopped cases from growing rapidly, along with other interventions. The best country at quarantining is Hong Kong. Hong Kong have reported one COVID-19 death per 54,000 people. Hong Kong has one of the highest population densities in the world, but by setting up mandatory isolation protocols and quarantine centers for people with COVID-19 and others in close contact with them, it has kept the cases number very low. The best country in economic protection is Denmark. Denmark have reported one COVID-19 death per 5,000 people. Some countries have excelled in securing individuals economically and medically. In Denmark, to prevent huge economic crisis, the government has paid a portion of the wages of workers in private businesses. Notable comparisons are to India, the European Union and Australia, which rapidly supplied lower-income individuals using electronic cash transfers. The best country at public communication is Finland. Finland have reported one COVID-19 death per 10,000 people. Many fake news and rumors was highly distributed at the beginning of the pandemic. Finland was one of the most successful countries to spread knowledge and to rebut fake news, supported by its high media literacy that educated people about how to counter false information. The best country at learning from recent epidemics is Liberia. Liberia have reported one COVID-19 death per 55,000 people. Liberia has suffered deeply from Ebola in 2014. And it was one of the first countries having restrictions on the airport and doing rapid testing full cases tracking and quarantine. Those are the countries that excelled the most in facing the pandemic. What do you think? Do you have some other opinion? 
please leave it in the comments section below. Please like and share the video to show your support.